This your boy DJ Jackie Dominic, and now it's a well-known fact that uh, crazy bitches got the best pussy. Come on, let's be serious, right? When you're fucking them, it feels like you're fucking multiple people. They got multiple personalities now. Makeup sex is usually the best. Now, I don't know what it is, man. Crazy chicks and good pussy just goes together. Now, listen, everybody probably has a crazy chick they've either fucked with or fucking with now. And you kind of want to leave, but you don't leave. Now, the, the, the type of crazy I'm talking about isn't like, ah, uh, yeah, I'm crazy. I'll call you a couple of times in a row even though you don't answer. I'm talking about she'll call you until your phone dies, right? She, I'm talking about the chick that says, yo, I'm a motherfucking kill myself. I'm not with you. That's the type of crazy I'm talking about. Now, I'm um, Ray Weather Jr. Now, he's known for finessing these chicks out of their panties. This nigga is pretty slick at getting the bitches. Now, he fucked a lot of chicks, including Kim Kardashian. It was even rumored that he even fucked one of the greats, Whitney Houston. But now, he's with this new chick, and this new chick, her name is uh, Princess Love, and pretty much he allegedly took her from fucking Floyd Mayweather, who wasn't donkey fucking her because he was training for boxing and all that, and Ray J got all the time in the world to fuck all these hoes. So, he took her from uh, Floyd Mayweather Jr. Now, he got this chick, got her on a reality show, loving hip-hop Hollywood, and then apparently he threatened to leave her, and then she said, I'm about to kill my motherfucking self. Now, the 911 tape actually leaked to this, where Ray J was calling into 911 saying, yo, my, my girl or my ex-girl about to kill her, herself over me. Now, this is actually crazy. Like, you guys are going to hear it in a second, because, I mean, hey, I don't get what, why chicks even do this, right? I mean, listen, I used to have a, a ex way back. Well, I remember, um, actually, I think it was when I was like 17. Now, she was a side chick, not even a main chick, a side chick. She was on a rotational 10-day contract. Every 10 days, she'd get her contract re-upped. But, of course, like, I mean, we were hella cool. Now, apparently, I think, I can't remember what happened, but we were about to stop talking or whatever it was. And I remember she texted me or called me, and she was like, yo, I'm sitting in a bathtub, and I'm taking pills. It was like fucking Advil or Tylenol or something like that. She's like, if I can't be with you... I'm killing myself. Now, I was over here like I was so young and fucking dumb and kind of flattered and also self-centered. I'm like, yo, really? You do that shit? I mean, I wouldn't even skip breakfast for you. What's wrong? What the fuck is going on? Now, she didn't kill herself, which is a good thing. But listen, man, if these chicks are planning or threatening to kill themselves over you, this is to fellas and females. Get the fuck away from them because we see with that Earl Hay shit, if they're trying to kill themselves over you, if you around, they will kill you too. Now, check out Ray Weather Jr. He's talking to the 911 uh, operator, and the 911 operator seems more interested in fucking Ray J than actually saving his girlfriend. Check this out. 911. Yo, I need I need help. Okay. Um, my girlfriend is like, she threatening to kill herself. Yeah. So it's, she's, at, she's at the house. I left the house because I got to go to work. Okay, what's the a ranch? It's a house. It's a house. Okay, and what is going on with her? Kill her? She's threatening to kill herself because... Because I'm telling her that she made me mad, and I don't want to, like, I want to, like, in the relationship. But what's happening is my friend, one of my one of my close friends, just killed him, just killed his girlfriend, and just killed himself two days ago. I know you probably heard about it in L.A. Yeah. A lot, though. That was my friend, right? So, right. And that was my friend that killed his girlfriend and killed himself. That so was your friend that my, killed his girlfriend and killed himself? Yeah, Earl Hayes, Earl Hayes at the Palazzo. He did it. He did it like two days ago. Yeah, we all, we all stunned about it. Okay, and now she's threatening to kill herself because she, because I want to do my thing and, and be away. So she keeps saying, "Just know that I want to see you in heaven." And so I just decided to call nine one one. Okay, okay. Like, what, what, like, what is your name? I'm on TV. She's on TV. Ray J. This is Ray J. Yeah, and my girls. I'm not about to run back over there and try to save you when you shoot me. Okay, Ray J, hold on one moment, okay? Man, so I need yeah. somebody to get over because, look, I went back over there right now to try to find the gun that she got, and she won't show it to me. Okay, she has a gun in the house? Yeah, and I'm like, I was going to take the clip out the gun. I'm like, listen, I promise. Okay, I need you. I, okay, slow down for a minute. Where are you at? I'm on my way downtown because I got to shoot a television show, but I'm parked on the side of the road. Okay. But I didn't want to be in the house because Earl just killed his girlfriend. I'm thinking she might... Kill me. Okay. Yeah, listen, stay on the line one moment. Don't hang up.